Hi there folks, Joel Self, Outdoor Instructor here. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today I am out leading a holiday club group, so a multi-activity day. We're gonna be doing some archery, some air rifle shooting, lowland hiking, and a little bit of indoor climbing to round our day off at the end as well. I'm gonna be taking out four young folk. They're all 10 to 15 years old, and we are gonna get stuck in and really, really enjoy these activities. I'm sure not all of them will have done all the activities in the past, so it'll be a bit of a learning curve, I'm sure, for a few of them, uh, but really, really excited to get going. So, let's see how we get on. Hello, I'm Rob. Hi, I'm Nathan. Sap, I'm Rupert. Hi, I'm Alex. Oh, excellent. In between those shoulder blades, Robert, that's it. Whoa, Whoa, spot on in the red. Give him a hand. Very nice, a matching shot in the red there, Alex. Gonna have some fierce competition between you guys later, I think. There we go. Just underneath. Oh, it's a good shot. Oh, there we go, it's I not far away. Not, not far at all. Who we got next? Me. Oh, who got doing that? It's there? probably gonna be last. There we go, we're gonna load that one up for us. Oh, it's away. Oh Whoa! my goodness. How close is that? We're talking Quite close. sort of two foot. That's a good shot there. Nathan's going there. land on top oh another good shot okay we're gonna go do some pacing and see who's closest where where is it I for us nathan back over there do you want to stand with it because we're going to pace these out in a moment i think i've won Maybe. so we'll, we'll pace them just so we know who's you know sort of how close we got but obviously in first place we got rupert who's managed to land it sort of two feet away then we've got alex then we've got Robert. It's close between you two gents, I reckon. And then in fourth place, we've got Nathan at the back there. Oh, shot very well. So I'm sure you've done the maths already between you, but that does mean. You beat us by nine points. Rob, you're bringing up fourth place for us. Then we've got Alex in third, Rupert in second, and Nathan in first. Very well done to all of you. Right, time yeah, to go for a walk. I'm going to What are we surrounded by here, Robert? Hazel. Yes, Hazel, yeah, plenty of it about. <laughs> what was it called where we cut it down like this at the bottom? Oh, stemming. Stemming, that's a good guess. Anyone else got a guess for what it was Stop. called? When we cut it down nice and low, the I hazel began with a C. Oh. Cutting it. Cutting it. I mean, that's what that's what we're doing. Yeah, is coppicing. If we cut it down nice and low, and grow up all those other shoots. Some stinging nettle. Some stinging nettle. Rupert's not sure. I'm gonna eat it. I'm, I'm gonna do it when someone says it's nice. Yeah. Three, two, one. Is it nice? It's not bad. No, it's not bad, is it? it They're like definitely not the most for most. For a plant, it's actually quite good. <laughs> yeah, as far as plants it go, it doesn't taste bad. I quite like it. Uh, that is quite good. It's not. <laughs> Alex ain't sure. Keep moving, please, gentlemen. That's what we're doing. Keep going. Yeah. Keep going. Lots of people get very worried about going into fields with large livestock or horses. And I must say, as long as you're sensible, quiet, calm about what you're doing, you've got no problem at all. These gentlemen have done a very good job sensibly walking through the field. Well done, guys. Not caused their horses any bother, and therefore they've caused us no bother. Hi, this is me, Rupert. I'm, I'm pro everything, and I hope that I get included in this video. 
My boy! You realise that that's going to be completely edited. He's not getting in the edit. <laughs> What's on the menu, gents? What we got? I had, I had a honeycomb chocolate thing. Honeycomb chocolate yeah. thing. And a, like a dried caramel chocolate thing. Oh yeah. And this is my brownie chocolate thing. Wow, lots of chocolate things. What are you, what you got, Alex? Is that ham? Um, ham roll. Ham roll. And a brunch bar. Oh. Um, cucumber. And what did I do? <laughs> Jammy Dodgers. Jammy Dodgers. Nathan has got a very crumbly looking something. Yeah, it's a Nathan. Oh, they are really good. I also got really tomatoes, crisps, and... Oh, so it's not, not all chocolate, then? I wish it was all chocolate. <laughs> what got down the end there, Robert? Sandwich, pepperoni, oh. two snack bars, fudge. I do enjoy some Biscuits pepperoni. Hoops, yeah. Are they jammy dodgers? They are. Oh, he's done well. He's done well for a lunch. I mean, I might just shoot the right. It's like right in my dog. No, do that one. I hit the right in Robert. <laughs> I think I hit it. Oh, that was a good noise, wasn't it? Hit it! I hit the red bit, but it didn't split. Good hit, Robert. It's your one, you get extra points. I definitely hit mine. How are you finding it? Anyway, this competition going to be a bit fierce, do you reckon? Yeah. Because the, the archery win. was surprisingly close, wasn't it? I I was. Was. So we might have, might have some close scores again. Yeah. See what we got? I got two nines. Are those two nines? nines? Are those classes nines? They are definitely nines. Yes. Brilliant. Um, so, did this break the line? Uh, this one's breaking the line. Uh, this one, just about, yeah. For the air rifles then, uh, Nathan, you're bringing up us in fourth place, 35 points. Well done. Uh, then we've got Robert uh, with 38 points. Well done, Robert. And Alex in second place, 49 points. And Rupert with 65 as a first place. Well done. Excellent. Good shooting from all of you there. Can you enjoy that? Yeah, yeah that was great fun. No oh, discovery, that one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is. It's nice to have some young Land Rover enthusiasts. I do approve. So, we're off to the caution climbing wall for our final session of the day. How's everyone found it? Good. Yeah, enjoying it. What yeah. was the best activity so far? Shooting, shooting, archery. shooting. Archery. Oh. Shooting I don't know. I, I, don't, you know. I, I like, like shooting and well. no, walk. No one's putting in a vote for the walk? The walk was alright. Yeah, it, right. it, it was quite a pretty it walk, wasn't it? I liked eating the nettles. <laughs> I liked eating, eating the nettles. Eating the nettles, good stuff. Yeah, that's nice. Excellent. Okay, gents, we are going to be doing a little bit of limbo. Has anyone played limbo before? Yeah. yeah? So we're going to be hopping on at the end of the wall here. Oh, You're going to climb across, and yes. you've got to go under this line oh, yes. without touching it. That's Once you get to this brown hold with both hands, you'll be safe, and you can hop down. Oh. Okay? Yes. Nathan's leading the way. fair way to decide who's going first so I would like to see a little rock paper scissors championship between you two you two and the winner will play each other from each side okay all right so our two winners who we got? okay so first second and you two need to play to find out who's going third and fourth third Four. It's just not your game, is it, mate? Yeah.
figure of eight. Nailed it. Shark attack! Shark attack! Oh no, he's down! Good effort from everyone there. Enjoyed it? Yeah, definitely. Good, good. Definitely. So, final thoughts, best session of the day, Robert? Very good session. Which one was the best one? Uh, probably climbing. Climbing was the best one for you. What about you, Nathan? Definitely climbing. Climbing, or oh. what do we um, think? Shooting or archery. Shooting or archery, Alex, nice. Okay, and last but not least, we've got... Air rifles. Air rifles, nice one. And there you have it, folks, the end of Holiday Club day one. It's been really, really such a fun day, super action-packed, great kids along to enjoy the activities, which is always a pleasure um, when we've got really nice folk to work with. And they were keen, get stuck in, have a go no matter what. So it's been a real success, I would say. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Do make sure that you hop below, like, comment, and subscribe whilst you're down there. And of course, if you've got any questions, do fire away. Or even if you're interested in having your own session, you can get in touch via my email address. It'll be down in the uh, description below. But for now, I've been Joel's Fatner Instructor. Thanks for watching. Ta-ra. Thank you.